Kelly nailed a good job with an air compressor. That's cool. That's wonderful. But right now we're going to do something very good. We're about three hours into our break so far. Are we doing any good here at HSN? Well, we're doing nice, sir. From here on out, there are people ready to be prepared for what's to come. And we are already prepared for Hurricane Irma. Yeah. Well, Irma made landfall in the Bahamas and Cuba before it can start making landfall here in Florida. I just want you to remember that, sis. Because, by the way, I agree whoever is going to Orlando may be the cutest people in the world. Are you going to Orlando, Regina? Yes. How about you, Sonia? Yes. Yes, I am going to Orlando with you. And Nikita? Yes, I'm going to Orlando with you guys. Emily? Yes, I'm going to Orlando with you. Lauren? Yeah, I'm going to Orlando with you. Donna? I'm going to Orlando with you. And Barb? I'm going to Orlando with you as well. But if you're ready, then don't forget about the best way to prepare for a hurricane like this. She may be a monster, I guess, because we know what's going to happen in the event of a hurricane quite like this. And you are going to be very happy and be well trained and prepared for what's to come next. Well, you should be very happy. As the storm made landfall in both Cuba and the Bahamas. Yeah, you're right, sis. I'm right about it too. But it'll be all right. We'll leave in several hours and close our St. Pete campus. If you could get a drink from the vending machine, you should. It'll be all right, though. And we are making plans to prepare for what's to come. It may be the worst of Hurricane Irma, but we know it is making landfall in Florida sometime soon. You're right about that. Well, Nikita, were you working with Peter and Matt? Yeah, I was working with Peter and Matt earlier in the day. Are you going to have some hurricane fun? Well, we sure are going to have some hurricane fun. Because it's usually fun here at HSN. It'll be fun here in Orlando. Over in Orlando, not here. Oh, well. Correct me if I'm wrong. Thanks for correcting me. Well, you got to be right about that. They are friends who want to have a lot of fun here at HSN. We know Tony Little's catchphrase. It's fun to enjoy Tony Little's catchphrase. What is it? You can do it! If you can prepare for Hurricane Irma, you can do it! <laughs> In the words of Tony Little. In the words of Tony Little. Yeah. Uh, of course. <laughs> As we may all know, we are going to be ready for the worst. All right. And we will have a chance to prepare for the worst of this storm. <coughs> Everybody's going to be good. <coughs> well, I'm sorry, sis. I me didn't mean to cough like that. Nikita, I didn't mean to cough at all, either. Oh, that was a bad cough for you, Eddie. Calm down and cool your jets, if you will. Because everybody's going to have to make preparedness actions. Are you kidding, sis? I am, Eddie. <sighs> We're going to have the worst of this hurricane before we know it. All right, we are making preparations as we speak. But how's Leslie doing? She's doing fine. 
She'll keep her family and friends safe, but we're gonna have to keep our families and friends safe. Because of Hurricane Irma, she's about to make landfall in Florida. She did it in Cuba and the Bahamas last night. Sure. Um, I can't believe she's going to be on a war path towards Florida. Oh, yeah. Barbara. Yes, Miss Harrison. What do you think about Irma? I can't believe she's going to be on the war path towards Florida. Yeah. We can't believe she's going to be on the war path toward Florida like you, Barb. I'm all right. What snacks are you going to have? Potato chips. Potato chips? I can't believe it. Says what snacks are you going to have? Again, I might have uh, Doritos, Cheetos, and other Lay's stuff. A lot of other people love to have Lay's potato chips. But who cares? <laughs> We have different drinks, such as Coke, and Pepsi, and water, and iced tea. Mountain Dew and Sprite are different products for Pepsi and Coke, respectively. Good. Well, I hope Annette is prepared as well. Maybe Annette can go to Orlando with us, but I guess Regina, Sonia... Nikita, Lauren, Emily, Donna, and Barb have to go with us to Orlando. Those are great models. They are great models indeed. But we are taking our precautionary and preparedness action seriously. Yeah. As we know how to keep the family safe. How about Natalie? Natalie might go with us. She told Peter that she has to go with us. To Orlando. There's a strong hotel there. And we know it's going to be a good deal for us to go there. Well, I can't believe the fun has just begun around here. As the storm makes landfall, who cares about all this? I agree that Irma is about to make landfall here in Florida. Hey, Natalie, how are you? Would you like to join us for the rest of our long journey? Sure, I will join us. I will join you in Orlando. Correct me if I'm wrong, but it is hurricane fun here in Orlando. No, over in Orlando, I'm sorry. Correct me if I'm wrong for sure. You gotta keep your words working, Natalie. Oh well, I'm sorry, Eddie. I wanna work hard. Hey, Donna. Donna? Yes, Eddie. Natalie was wrong, but I had to correct her. Oh, well. I'm very happy to be a survivor. Uh, gosh, sis. I can't believe Natalie was wrong. She sure was wrong indeed. But I thought it would be a fair deal for someone to prepare for a hurricane like this. Is it going to be a monster hurricane, Natalie? It may be a monster hurricane, Eddie. But who cares about monster hurricanes? Hurricane Andrew was a monster hurricane back in 1992. Are you right about that, sis? Yeah, I'm right about that, Eddie. I'm right about Hurricane Andrew, which hit Florida in 1992. He was a powerful storm. I hope Irma might be as powerful as Andrew when she hits the Tampa Bay area of Florida. Yep. That's where this building, our HSN campus, is located in St. Petersburg, Florida. And we are trying to take precautionary and preparedness actions during our difficult time. Actually, it's not a difficult time for us here at HSN, but it's a difficult time for some other people who live in the Tampa Bay area of Florida. And by the way, have you said Tony's catchphrase earlier? Yeah, you can do it! You can prepare for the worst of a monster hurricane in Florida. What do you think, Natalie? Well, Miss Harrison, 
I was wrong about what I said, and Eddie corrected me. Is that my brother? Yes. I guess Eddie's your brother. Well, thanks, Natalie, for that. I'm very excited to have some fun. And my brother Eddie and I were waking up to a good day. We had donuts. I can't believe we had donuts the rest of the 5 a.m. hour. Well, here's the catch. Suzanne was nailing a great show. And I hope that videotape equipment will continue to work during and after Hurricane Irma. Our videotape equipment may still be working. Right. Oh, well. I can't believe the videotape equipment for us here at HSN is outside Florida as we speak. If it's outside Florida, hopefully the videotape equipment will still work here during and after the hurricane. Oh, well. It will still be able to work. Ugh. We are drinking tea to relax our throats and possibly soothe our throats. We are relaxing and I can't believe we are all coming together to go to Orlando. Well, sis, I guess uh, Bobby, Adam, Suzanne, and Sarah are preparing for a good storm. Oh, well. Barb, where's Dustin going? He's going somewhere else. But I'm coming with you guys to Orlando. All right. Peter and Matt are joining us. And Peter, what do you think about Hurricane Irma? Do I think, um... She's going to do well after she hit Cuba and the Bahamas last night. Yes, she did hit Cuba and the Bahamas last night. She's going to be on the warpath toward Florida anytime soon. And here's Barbara. She may be the best fitness model in the history of HSN. And she's well trained. Oh, well. How are you doing, Barb? We're in the HSN lounge, having fun and being prepared. Well, I'm relaxing on that couch again, like I do on that encore tape. On that videotape, Barb? Sure. How about you, Donna? Are you sitting like you're doing on the videotape? Yeah, I'm sitting there. How about this young lady right here? Is she going to have to be a great hurricane expert? Yes. Well, I can't believe I've known you for many years, Donna. When it comes to preparedness for the storm, what you may think about it is that it could be a Category 5 hurricane, but is expected to be downgraded to a Category 3, Category 2, Category 1, or Tropical Storm anytime soon. All right. I watched a video on my laptop and found out what the governor thinks. Do you know where Dustin's gone, Donna? Dustin may be going somewhere else. But I think he'd be all right after all his preparations for Irma were made. Well, you got a feeling at last. Come on. I thought a friend in mine would have to look forward to some strong event. In this case, the same friend right over here is having a hurricane party. Oh, yeah. We're having the first part of our Hurricane Irma party right here at HSN in our campus in St. Pete. Yes, we are, Eddie. I know, Donna. Natalie, are you joining in the hurricane party with us? Even in Orlando? Yes, Eddie. I sure am going to join the fun. Who cares about you? Uh, well, I care about myself. Even my sister Kelly cares about me. 
Are you right about that, Natalie? I sure am right about that, Eddie. Well, thank you for your tip. Have you worked any fashion shows? Yes. I've worked the DG2 shows, and I've worked many Slinky brand shows. Um, Natalie, I can't believe you did any of those shows. Well, I've done DG2. I've done Slinky brand. I've done a whole bunch of fashion shows in the past here at each other. You sure did a lot of fun, Natalie. Well, you gotta be kidding. How long has it been for you here at HSN? Quite a long time here. Good for you, Natalie. You're welcome, Eddie. Hey, I bet Connie is looking good. Our friend Connie is also making preparations with who I think are her son Doug Jr. or Dougie. Oh, well. And of course, the lovely and talented husband of his, Doug. Do you think Doug is Connie's husband? I think Doug is Connie's husband, for sure. But I don't care about all this. But who cares about all this? Sis? I do. I do. Hey, Donna. Yes, Eddie. Have you slept on a bed quite like the one that Ellen was talking about with a friend of hers? Yes. I agree on that corner mattress pad that everybody loves. Everybody loves to sleep on a bed quite like that. <laughs> Ellen felt that the bed may have not had any sheets and pillows and blankets. Well, the bed actually did have pillows, but not sheets. Ellen was touching the good old thing by feeling something on the mattress pad. Yeah. Ellen was a good friend, for sure. And I know who she was with. Leslie. Leslie? You're right about that. Hopefully there's going to have to be a hurricane named Leslie next year. Will there be a hurricane named Valerie? Yeah, there may be a hurricane named Valerie next year either. <laughs> as well as a hurricane named Sarah. Sarah. That hurricane would be named after our show host, Sarah, who's been with us for several months. So, could Leslie, Sarah, and Valerie be hurricanes next year? Yep. They'd be named after the show hosts who have been with us at HSN over the years. Leslie's been with us since 2011, and Sarah's been with us for several months. Valerie's been with us for over a year. That's a good guess, Betty. You're right, sis, but things are going straight for Donna. Donna, do you have some hurricane supplies of yours? I do have some hurricane supplies of mine, Eddie. And I can't wait to be prepared for a good storm. What do you think about, about your fashion shows, Donna? Well, I think about them because I have modeled on shows for Slinky Brand fashion. I like wearing a lot of Slinky Brand fashion. And by the way, I usually work the slinky shows. You usually do work the slinky shows, Donna. Good deal. But I agree with everybody. Sis, you and I would love to keep models like Donna safe in the event of a hurricane. Oh, well. We're going to have to help Donna get to safety when the hurricane approaches. It'll be all right. 
we are helping models get to safety. Good deal. We like when our models hear they just and get to safety. Yeah, good deal. And I hope Leslie gets to safety because of Irma. Oh, well. What do you think of Ellen, Eddie? I hope Ellen gets to safety as well. I hope she stays away from Irma's warpath toward Florida. You're right, Eddie. I agree, sis. <coughs> Nikita. <coughs> Hi. Hi, Eddie. Hi again. Well, that's a bad cough for you. Well, I may be sorry, Nikita. You're right about that, Eddie. When you cough, I say bad cough. Yeah, bad cough on the day before the hurricane. I hope a good feeling at last has to be a really good feeling. Well, what do I think about it? Well, I gotta be strong. I have to eat and drink to be strong. Me too. I eat and drink to be strong as well. And so do the models who will go with us to Orlando to wait out Hurricane Irma. She is like a powerful storm. And Donna, I know she's going to bring big rain and she's going to bring big winds and she's going to possibly bring a big storm surge to the Tampa Bay area of Florida and maybe other parts of Florida. What do you think, Donna? I think of my friend, former show host Bill, and uh, another show host, Marlo. What do you think of Bill and Marlo? Well, their hometown of Miami is about to get hit hard by Irma. Oh, well, sis. I can't believe that Donna told me that Bill and Marlo's hometown of Miami is about to get hit hard by Hurricane Irma. Oh, well. Donna, what do you think of that hurricane? I think the hurricane is going to hit somewhere. What do you think, Donna? What else do you think? It'll be all right, because I hope the hurricane is about to hit Florida really hard. That's right, Donna. I can't believe that Irma is about to make more landfall here in Florida. I think she's going to hit Florida really hard. She's on the warpath toward Florida, almost. Do you think she's almost on the warpath? Yes, Donna. I agree, Eddie. Do you have good hurricane supplies, Donna? Yes, Eddie. How about you, Natalie? Yes, Eddie. How about you, Barb? Yes, Eddie. How about you, Sonia? Yes, Eddie. We sure are making preparations for a monster. Oh, well. Are you kidding? I am kidding, Eddie. You're right about that, Sonia. And Regina, what do you think? Well, I have a bunch of hurricane supplies, such as an Abra, a stormy sky Abra in this case. Good deal. But if your friends are looking forward to a terrific day here at HSN, the day is going to be as much fun as it used to be a long time ago when hurricanes Charlie, Francis, Ivan, and Jean hit Florida really hard. They brought big rain, they brought big winds, and each storm had brought a possibility of a storm surge. Well, Leslie decided to read an article that there was a hurricane quite like that. But right now, 
were in the midst of preparing for Hurricane Irma. Are you kidding, Eddie? Well, I'm kidding. Straight off the bat, Donna. <laughs> hey, Seth. I hope Donna is almost ready for the hurricane. We can help get Donna to safety. As much as we can get other models to safety, in this case. Regina, Sonia, Lauren, Nikita, Emily, Barb, and of course, some beloved HSN fans. Here's the first HSN fan I'd like for you to meet. Hi, Joe. How are you? I am doing great, guys. Do you like watching HSN a lot? Yep. I spend most of my life watching HSN. But I usually play golf at a golf place inside one of the golf clubs. Have you played golf at a club before, Joe? You're right about that, Eddie. So, Joe, what's your last name? Wells. Joe Wells is his name. Uh, hey, Donna. I've got a fan from HSN who loves this network so much. Joe Wells is his name. He really loves a chance of being a golf spectator and loving to watch a golf event on TV and in golf clubs. Have you played golf a lot, Joe? Well, Eddie, I've played a lot of golf since I was a young kid. Even in high school, I've been playing golf. I can't believe you played golf when you were in high school. Oh my goodness. Well, the models and my sister Kelly and I are playing a good role in preparing for Hurricane Irma. I'm Eddie Harrison. This is my sister, Kelly, and we've got models Regina, Sonia, Emily, Donna, Barb, Lauren, and of course, Natalie's with us, too. But I agree more with Natalie. Which HSN model do you like the best, Joe? I like to watch Donna model the slinky thing. Donna models for Slinky Brand? Oh, well. That's very exceptional, Joe. I cannot wait to have some fun this early in the morning with friends like you. Who's right there, Joe? Oh, well. You should grab a cup of coffee if you can. So I'm right about that. And a friend had to go fishing one morning. Is that true, Joe? Yep, I love fishing advice. Oh well, I agree more. But after the storm passes, things will get back to normal here at HSN. Our campus is located right here in St. Petersburg, Florida, the city by the bay with the world's best beaches. Can you believe it, Joe? Because I know I can. I can't believe it, Eddie. You'll be right about the time. So, if you're going to Orlando with us, you'd have to ride with Peter and Matt. Oh, well. Do you know that you were going to ride out the storm somewhere else, Joe? Yet, I do need to ride out a storm like that. Of course, in Nashville. I'd actually go there with Adam and Bobby and Sarah and Suzanne. Well, that's good news. We were just happy to make a move, right? And we are in the back seat of a car one day, and we focused a lot about hurricane preparedness for Tampa Bay. <laughs> this is going to be exciting for people who want to have some preparedness actions as we go nuts with this hurricane right here. Oh, yeah. We might look up some information about Irma on the internet. Can't believe she hit Cuba and the Bahamas. Do you think so, Eddie? Yeah. I think Irma made landfall in both Cuba and the Bahamas. We are working to keep the rest of the family safe during this massive time. 
the time is easy. Of course, there's more Ellen. There was a tape of Ellen with Leslie, and now there's more Ellen. This time with Brett, who did the last show before this, a special time of need. I know it's going to be a good time for Hurricane Irma, and she is a good hurricane that may have made landfall here in town, in the beautiful town of Florida. Oh, well. I can't believe it! <laughs> well, hi again, Peter. Hi, Eddie. How are you? I'm doing fine. How are you? Good. Well, meet Joe Wells. Meet Joe Wells. He's a great fan of HSN, and he loves to have a good feeling whatsoever. What show host may Joe have loved, Peter? Brett. I can't believe it. Joe, what do you think? I like Brett. Well, you heard Peter talk about his decision that you like Brett. What other host do you like? Well, I like Alice from Dallas. Yeah, you sure do like Alice from Dallas indeed. I agree more. But with thanks to a bunch of other people who are making preparedness actions right now, they are thinking about a time in need to be prepared for the worst of a disaster quite like this. Are you kidding, sis? Joe Wells has worked very hard to ensure that he has the best viewership on HSN. He's one of the coolest viewers in the history of our sister channel, HSN2. And he watches a lot of HSN reruns on that channel. I can agree with that. I love to see Joe Wells survive Hurricane Irma. Well, if you could see Joe survive Hurricane Irma, he'd be very happy to make medical records. Oh, well. When should he make a doctor or dentist appointment? Sometime after Irma, after the storm passes. We'd be just fine. Okay. We might be just fine, right? Right. And the storm ain't going to pass for a while as the storm begins. Oh, sure. Do you think so? I'm going to have to correct you because you're wrong about that. Oh, no. Well, I guess Joe will have to work hard, and he had to be given dentist and the doctor appointments a long time ago. Well, he has to get more doctor and dentist appointments when the storm passes. After the storm passes, Joe will go to the doctor and the dentist, sis? Okay. That would be fine. Joe, I can't believe you're going to have to go to a doctor or a dentist. After Hurricane Irma passes. I know. Yeah, you're right. We are going to be in a lot of trouble. Because of Irma? Yes, sis. I agree, Eddie. And our challenge, the best we can make, is to have fun and be safe during a storm quite like this. And as we know, a lot of people are making preparations for the storm. So why not you, sis? I should be ready for a close eye on the storm. Everyone would love to be prepared for a disaster quite like this. Everyone loves Brett, and he wants to be prepared for a good storm quite like this. Well, Brett decided that Irma is about to make landfall here in Florida, a very nice way of saying a good time is going to be so much good. Oh, well, so much better. That's right. Correct me if I'm wrong. Thanks for correcting me, sis. You're welcome, Eddie. We had a bunch of bloopers so far 
during this our long break from our live programming here at HSI. Are we going to have some fun today? Yes, we are. We are going to have a hurricane party first up here and then in Orlando. The first half of the party will be here at HSN, and the second half of our party will be in Orlando. We don't have to worry. We got a hurricane warning. Oh, well. We may be under a hurricane warning, but things are okay. It's all right. There should be a chance the hurricane warning will last long. I hope the hurricane warning doesn't last too long. Oh, well. I guess the hurricane warning may be in effect for the Tampa area. Yep. It may be in effect for all of Tampa Bay, including Pinellas County. Yes, Peter. I bet you should be right about that. Well, I can't believe it. Good news is really good news. What do you think, Eddie? I think we are under a hurricane warning right now, and we are making preparations. Oh, yes. We here at HSN are under a hurricane warning as we speak. Oh, look. You should be right about that. And things are getting a good look. I mean, um... Things are doing better when we have a good look. When we're getting a good look. Well, that's all right. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm sorry, Eddie. That's okay, sis. We've had some bloopers this time around. Oh, well. All we have to do is have some fun, right, Eddie? You're right about that, sis. Peter and Matt are working hard to make preparations. Are they continuing to prepare for Irma? Yep. Peter and Matt are continuing to make preparations as we speak. But it may be a hard time for some of us down here in Tampa Bay. But I'm pretty sure it's an easy time for all of us here at HSN to get out and go out on a hurricane vacation to Orlando while Bobby and Suzanne and Adam and Sarah all go out to Nashville. Some of us are going to Orlando and, of course, some hosts, like our newest host, Michelle, they're going to have to shelter in place in their old homes. I mean, they're going to have to shelter in place in their own homes, not old, but own. I'm sorry, correct me if I'm wrong. Oh, yeah. That's okay, Eddie. We've had bloopers. Oh, wow. You've got to be kidding. There are people waiting in the wings to make preparations, especially HSN fan Joe, who in this case loves to watch HSN a lot. Sometimes he'd watch HSN too for encore presentations of exciting products. And next, there would be fun, and there's a great way to have it. Well, it's usually fun here at HSN's St. Pete campus, but we are about to have hurricane fun over in Orlando as we speak. And again, we're under a hurricane warning now. Oh, well. Hoping that Orlando is or isn't under a hurricane warning. Yeah. I can't believe it. Peter, you know that we're under a hurricane warning as we speak, right? Right. We sure are under a hurricane warning. Oh, yeah. We got to be prepared. Hey, Regina. Regina, guess what? What, Eddie? We're under a hurricane warning. Yes, we are, Eddie. Sonia, we're under a hurricane warning. I know, Eddie. How about you, Nikita? 
I know that we're all under a hurricane warning now. And I can't believe there is the fun has just been going on here at HSN a few hours. That's right. It's been going on for a couple of hours now. And how about you, Sonia? Oh, well. I agree more. And I heard you say that we're under a hurricane warning. Are you right? Yeah, we sure are under a hurricane warning. Indeed, Sonia. You got to be prepared just like us. <laughs> hey, Emily. Yes, Daddy? You heard me say that we're under a hurricane warning. Is that right? Right. We had to be prepared and head out the door to Orlando. That's where we're all going. Some of us are relaxing in our own homes, while the others are going straight to Nashville. But we're going to Orlando. This part of our group here at HSN is going to Orlando. I guess a good volunteer is going to Orlando as well. All right. What HSN fan are we going to meet next? Well, um, a friend in a wheelchair. A wheelchair-bound man may have had a decision to ride out a hurricane on a charter bus. Oh, well. The man, the wheelchair-bound man may have to take a charter bus to the hotel. Oh, yeah. And, of course, he'd have to ride the elevator. Yeah, can't believe he's going to have to ride an elevator for sure. Well, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, this guy is a wheelchair-bound man. He's a mentally disabled man. He was indeed born with a good condition. He has had many conditions relating to autism. In this case, they are for sure autism-related conditions. We ladies and gentlemen have a weather emergency, young man. We are under a hurricane warning in this case. Yes, we are under a hurricane warning as we speak. Oh yeah. Okay. Things are going to be all right for us. Regina, what do you think? I really can't believe we're under a hurricane warning. Oh, well. I don't know how long the hurricane warning for us here in the Tampa Bay area is going to take. We might be under the extreme wind warning during the hurricane warning. You're right, Nikita. Hey, Donna, what do you think? We are under a hurricane warning. I told somebody that we were under a hurricane warning. We might be under an extreme wind warning if needed, during the hurricane warning. Hopefully there would be a tornado warning during the hurricane warning as well. Yeah, there could be a hurricane warning for us. A lot of people say that we're under a hurricane warning now. Donna, be glad we're under a hurricane warning, and we can help you get to safety right away. Yes. Are you going to help me get to safety? I can't believe that all of Tampa Bay is under a hurricane warning. Oh, man. Barbara, we're under a hurricane warning as we speak. I told many models that we're under a hurricane warning. And I don't know the hurricane warning very well if I don't know the hurricane warning correctly. But I know about the hurricane warning too much. You're right about that. Barb. Yes, Betty. We sure are under a hurricane warning as we speak. I hope you can get to safety with us here in Orlando. I mean, there in Orlando. I'm sorry, we're here at the HSN campus in St. Pete. Correct me if I'm wrong. 
but we will be going to Orlando. Oh, is that where we're going to go? Yes. There's a strong hotel there, and we are going to make it. How about our friend Trevor? You can say that again, Donna. I guess Trevor is going to have to make it to Nashville. Do you think he's going to have to make it to Nashville? I guess, but he says he's actually going to Orlando. So, he's going to have to go to Orlando with us. He's not actually going to Nashville. So correct me if I'm wrong. I can't believe Trevor's going to Orlando. There you go. You got it, Donna. And Miss Harrison thinks about you. In this case, it's my sister, Kelly, who knows a lot about HSN as we speak. Well, you're right about that. And a friend of mine may have notified a lot of people like Connie. Oh, yeah. Connie may have had a smartphone. She knows how to prepare for a storm quite like this. Well, it sure is a monster hurricane as we speak. Things are going our way, Donna. Read about that, Miss Harrison. Oh, yeah. Donna thinks she should be prepared for the hurricane. Oh, well. How about a good woman named Deborah? She's gonna have to stay out of Hurricane Irma's war path. Oh well. There's a cute woman who loves to shop bait just then. And with many thanks, I'd appreciate that woman right away. And I do believe there are a lot of people in preparedness right now. A friend could put his cup of tea down this instant. Yes, yes, yes. Thanks, Barb. You're welcome, Maddie. And now I can't believe we're under a hurricane warning. Mm -hmm. We are preparing for Hurricane Irma.